All right, all right, all right, guys. We are on here checking out Polymath the price, okay? Daily chart people, then you might be a little bit happy. This was at, I, I believe it was like 3 cent or something like that. Now it is at 0 0.46. All right, so if you're trying to purchase a cryptocurrency and this is not investment advice, I strongly suggest always reading the white paper or uh, and the roadmap. As you can see, there's a link to the white paper right here. It's not difficult. And you can also go to the website. Remember, don't just go off a of hype. I'm saying these things to keep you guys safe. I'm not a hater and all of that extra stuff. I don't care about this part. If you're going to invest into something, you should always know what it's about what is going to do, what the plans are for longevity purposes, okay? Now, if you Google, uh, I guess I can show you guys. Uh, let's go back to Poly Crypto. All right, keep watching. What does Polymav do? Uh, is Polymav a good investment? Um, it was one of these that was talking about how you should be prepared for it to be a good long-term investment, okay? So if you're looking to just hop in this and think you're going to get rich overnight, I wouldn't suggest doing it. The ones that actually mean something, that's actually trying to become a driving force with crypto in this world, those are not the ones you just buy and then panic sell. So I strongly suggest doing your research deeper into polymath. I'm not a professional at polymath. I don't know too, too much about it. Uh, the projects look promising, but do your own research. And it's as simple as going to the roadmap. As you can see right here, you can click the roadmap and see exactly what their plan is. And what you want to do is follow along step by step and make sure they're applying implementation to these cryptocurrencies using what they're saying in the white paper and in their roadmaps. If they're actually following those, then it should roll out how they, they say it if they're good at what they're doing. But if not, then I wouldn't even suggest getting in in the first place. I don't base my investments off of this. Maybe you guys do because you're just trying to get a quick buck. But if you're a long-term holder and you're waiting for mass adoption of cryptocurrency as a whole, then I suggest buying into cryptocurrencies that are not based off of hype or meme that can actually have longevity and do your research just to stay safe. All right. Love you guys. See you guys in the next one.